Your fear of looking stupid is holding you back. Hey girlies, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna do some Fulani braids. So this is not the first time I am doing Fulani braids. I did Fulani braids on my TikTok and on YouTube Shorts. So they went viral on YouTube Shorts, then later on they went viral on TikTok. So, a little bit of explanation. I'm sorry I've been MIA. Um, we've been hit with um, a hurricane, hurricane barrel. So we didn't have light for five days. And then um, I got sick. So a lot of things happened that made this video late. But still, I hope you still enjoy the video and like and subscribe and follow me on my other social media like Instagram, TikTok and on here. So let's get into the video. So I've been using Zimis as my main leave-in conditioner right now. So I use Zimis. I didn't have any oil, so I used the Zimis. And then I used um, a little grease and a little gel for my end. So you see me doing the first corner. The first corner is always the hardest corner to do. I had to redo this corner like two times before I got it right the first time but then it tangled so I had to undo it and do it over back so enjoy me doing my Falani braids So I get most of my hairstyles off Pinterest. I use Pinterest a lot. Like if I'm going to change protective style and do another one, I usually scroll through Pinterest to see which one I like and then take inspiration from that. I also have a Pinterest account so you can follow me on there. I post like my hair and I make like, I make like some content with text, like exp explanation, like explaining herbs like what i use in my hair so you can check that out on my pinterest Let me say this, doing your own hair is a task because I was sitting in this chair for hours. I sit in from like, I think I started, um, I think in the evening, like two o'clock, three o'clock, and I finished at nine o'clock. I'm not entirely sure why I know I've been sitting for hours. And I, I had my little assistant, but mostly what took me so long is the cane rolls. Cause if I was just like plaiting my hair, like the mini braids, I would be done in like two, three hours. But you would all of the cane roll and the parting, and then I have to make sure the I'm filming and holding thing.
Yay, so we finally finished the cane roll. All that's left to do is put in the braids and I'm free parting. Cause if I don't do that, I will be here for the next couple of hours. So free parting it is, let's get to it. And with um, any progressive style I do, I try to at least make it last for one month. If it's like a style where I can just redo the front, I'll do that and leave the back. But I try to go to one month because when you go like that long without touching your hair, it grows out the root and you help you retain it from your doing your moisture method. So I find that that works for me because I am a type of person who loves playing in my hair. So when I do this, it helps me to retain length. So try to keep your protective style in for one month, at least one month. If you can't go to full month, try it in three weeks. You're, you're gonna thank me, trust me. So after I finish doing the braids and the bats, I just add some more, some water and then add some more leaving to my hair to kind of like seal the deal. Then I add gel on, onto it also. So I end up, end up adding beads to this style. Sometimes I don't really like the beads because when my hair is so tall, they get tangled real easily. So I was back and forth if I should put in the beads, but I decided to put them in for the first week. I loved it, but I couldn't like manage the tangles. The tangles were out of this world as every day I had to pull out the tangles. But it it give it pull off the look. It pull off the look. It was it was it was a look. It was bomb. I actually like it, like the style. Even though I didn't and it's not the first time I'm doing full line braids still, but in the the first part, the kino part, this is the first time doing that kino style. But I like it. So we're finished. It took a couple hours, but we got it done. This is the back part of my hair. And let me say, this style is bomb. It's bomb. I would definitely do it again. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.